All right, so this video will show you how to get your project ready to be sent to the laser cutter. So I've got my design opened in Illustrator, and then I'm also signed into Google Drive. You can tell that by the bottom right toolbar where you see the Google Drive icon that's colored. If you don't see the Google Drive icon, you need to go to the left-hand side of your screen and type in Drive, and then open up this app and sign in with your school email account and password. So I have my design. I'm going to select everything in my design. I'm going to go to type and make sure that I've selected create outlines. This will make that make sure that all the text and everything in my design is an outline form so that the laser can cut this out. Once I've done that, I'm going to go to file and export. I'll choose export as and then it's going to bring me to the location where I can save my work. I need to make sure that I'm in my Google Drive. So I'll double click on Google Drive on the left-hand side. Then I'll double click on my drive. And then I will look for a folder for this class. I'm logged in as a student currently, and I don't know that I have a folder for this class, but it's a good idea to create folders for each of your classes. Next, we are going to name our file. and it's good to put your last name in your project. And then from this drop-down list, it's probably gonna look like this at first. Click here and choose SVG. Then you're going to click Export. You'll click OK. And that file is now ready to be sent. Next, you'll go to your email. can get to your email by going to my.bvsd.org. Open up your Gmail account. Click on Compose. You're going to send this to tidelaser at gmail.com. And then the last step is to attach the file. So you'll go back to your drive. And you'll find your file. You'll click open, and then you're going to click send. Make sure it's a .svg file. It shouldn't be any other option. It has to be a .svg file for this to work. 